Millions of years ago in our planet's ancient waters, long before the whales, dolphins and porpoises had begun to appear, there lived a group of remarkable reptiles that evolved to fill in many of the positions occupied by these much younger animals. These creatures were, of course, the ichthyosaurs. Dr. Dean Lomax has had a fascinating and inspiring journey into the science of paleontology, and his research on ichthyosaurs has revealed all sorts of exciting new things about the biology of the animals. All Dean wanted to do when he grew up was to become a paleontologist. However, the place in which he lived unfortunately offered little in the way of paleontological experience, and he was told, more than once, that he would never become a paleontologist. So, instead of going to university at the age of 18, Dean decided he would make his own path into the science. He started to volunteer at the museum in his hometown. He first rediscovered a huge collection of over 10,000 specimens within the museum, before then identifying a particular specimen of an ichthyosaur kept in the museum, which had been thought to be a very good cast, as a real fossil. But then, even more excitingly, Dean discovered that this same specimen was in fact an example of a brand new species of ichthyosaurus. Dean never actually did an undergraduate degree, but he has now completed a Master of Philosophy degree in Paleontology based on his research, as well as finishing a PhD at the University of Manchester in 2019. Dean has been a remarkably prolific scientist. Dean also described the first example of a pregnant Leptonectes. Then, in 2014, Dean published on a specimen of Ichthyosaurus breviceps which had been collected by Mary Anning. In 2016, Dean named and described an entirely new genus and species of ichthyosaur. Then, in 2017, Dean and Professor Masseri were able to name another two species of ichthyosaurus. After this, Dean, with paleontologist Mike Boyd, described an intriguing fossil specimen from Yorkshire that preserved between six and eight embryos of ichthyosaurs along with fragments of some of the adults' ribs. In 2018, Dean was then part of a team that examined several mysterious bones found in Somerset and Gloucestershire, revealing them to have most likely all belonged to some incredibly huge ichthyosaurs, potentially reaching the 30 meter or more range, and therefore quite possibly getting bigger than a blue whale. And it's not just some incredible research on ichthyosaurs that Dean has done. He's published papers on all sorts of other amazing paleontological discoveries too, writing over 40 academic papers in total. And Dean isn't just a great researcher, but also an award-winning science communicator. Dean has additionally presented many talks about his research, dinosaurs, ichthyosaurs, and other things to audiences of all kinds, taking part in hundreds of outreach events. Dean has also appeared in various programs on TV as well as the radio, often consulting as an expert and as a presenter. So, as you can see from Dean Lomax's unique and inspiring journey, there are all kinds of ways that you can follow your passion and end up doing what you love. I hope Dean's story has enabled you to realise this, and I hope you'll continue to follow him and the exciting future discoveries I'm sure he'll make. 